All right, this is my response video to uh, Brent033Run's uh, channel. He's got a giveaway going. Um, outstanding channel, man. I mean, I'll put the link down below to his channel. You gotta go check him out. But he's got a giveaway going also, so this is part of that. Everything, man, he's asked a few questions. So I got my notes here, so I didn't forget all of it. Uh, my first name, my first name is Torren. Spelled it, spelled T-O-R-R-E-N. It's a... Uh, Scandinavian name, of course I was born right here in the United States, and uh, so it's kind of a play off all those uh, names, you know, Torrance, Terrence, the whole whole works like that, Torrent. It's uh, from everything I've ever described about, or seen and described about it, all that stuff, all those names like that come from Thor. The thunder god they're all inspired by it so yeah cool cool i hated it when i was a kid because it was so different but now you know over the last 30 years i love it so because it is different but now i've actually met some people or seen some people that have that exact same name um anyway that's my first name Torin. and i'm from oklahoma i'm just right north of you brent right there so i mean i'm just right up here right up north and then what i like about your channel Man, you know, it's kind of, I was thinking about that, and it's hard to pick because there's so much good stuff on your channel. And I'm not just saying that. I really mean that. You know, I, I came to your channel a long time ago looking at camouflage effectiveness stuff. And um, just everything that you do, because you have quite a few of those videos of different camouflages throughout, you know, from the United States all the way to, uh, you know, all around the world different camouflage and it's it's very cool to see stuff like that because I've always been a fan of camouflage ever since I was young um, and to see you know the different types of patterns that are used and see them you know used in an environment that's very similar to mine because you're in Texas I'm in Oklahoma our environments are very similar same kind of trees same kind of land layout we're we're in the mid plains you know so all that stuff so very cool so it, it kind of helps me like when I try to like find camouflage that will work in my area is I look to you uh, for some of that you know ideas and stuff to check it out because our environments are similar throughout the year through summer spring and winter and fall but uh man like I said I mean it comes through so much there, there's so, so much stuff that I've seen on your channel all the way from the the military infantry tactics and um Man, your 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 uh, battle recreation scenarios that you and Bruce and uh, the one other guy you have several people that help you on that, and um, but man, those things are awesome. I enjoy the hell out of those a lot because those are that's very cool, that's very cool, and uh, puts that's that's a lot of time and effort just to get everybody coordinated, get everybody to do all that stuff. Because I mean, you're basically making a mini movie, you know, and. Um, to get everybody to do that and so everybody's got to know their parts and their places and what they're doing and everything very cool man and all the editing that just goes into it that's very cool so I, and I look forward to those and your Christmas every year your Christmas videos you know when Santa infiltrates the house whether he's you know or the uh, or the terrorist infiltrates your house trying to take the gifts those are cool videos man those are and you can get your wife in there and she's coming down the stairs too with the gun I'm like that's awesome man you know that's that's very cool so, man, so it's kind of really hard for me to pick, like, one thing, you know, um, about your channel that I like, because I like, I really do like everything, but the camouflage effectiveness stuff is what brought me to your channel, and how long I've been subscribed, man, I can't, um, four or five years at least, so, and um, I'm not going anywhere, and you also wanted to see the weapon. This is what I would put that scope on. So, not an airsoft rifle. So, there we go. Bolt is back. It's a real one. And, being that it's got the removable carry handle, that scope will fit really nice on here. And something like that, for this length of rifle, would be fantastic. So, yes. That's it. That's the one. But, uh, so.
So I'm going to put the link down below to this channel. If you like that kind of stuff, camouflage effectiveness. I mean, he, if you don't know who he is, Brent is a Marine. I think he's still active in the reserve somehow, some, some way in some fa fashion. Uh, the one shepherd stuff that you uh, and the other guys talk about and everything, I'd love to attend that. If I can ever afford it and get the time to do it, I'd love to, because that, that looks awesome and that's a very cool thing to do, especially for people like me who have not been in the military. Um, um, you know, I would, have, I would have joined the military when I was younger. I would have done it. I look back on my life and I kind of wish I would have. Um, I had a different path, you know, that's why I'm Survivor Metal Man is because I went and played heavy metal instead. I discovered weed and heavy metal in my teenage years and boom, that was my direction for a long time. And I actually went, you know, I did some of that stuff semi-professionally, long story, but I don't regret that one bit. I, that was a, a dream of mine, but if I had, if I uh, wouldn't have done that, you know, that was my other path that I probably would have taken is military. And um, I probably would have been in in the early 90s, you know, so if I would have done that, because I'm 52 now. But uh, it, it, it's, you know, I grew up, you know, I've got a lot of military in the family and things like that. And, and all different kinds of incarnations of uh, combat and, and in different uh, campaigns, you know, Vietnam, Korea. Uh, grandfather in World War II, great grandfather in World War I, um, a cousin that was in uh, uh, the, uh, the Gulf War, and then I got a cousin that was in the War on Terror pretty much in uh, doing the entire time. I mean, he just retired out of it after 20 some years, a couple of years back. So he was, did all that kind of stuff. So very cool. And so yeah, I'm really, you know, so all that stuff. So if you guys are interested, I'm just rambling on here, making a longer video than I need to. But if you're uh, interested in, in uh, that kind of stuff, camouflage effectiveness, um, military tactics and, and infantry tactics and, and just all kinds of stuff. And even some recreation battle scenarios and things like that and shooting videos and guns and, and optics and all that stuff. I mean, outstanding channel, Brent 0331. Um, I will put a link down below and go check him out, subscribe, tell him I sent you and all that. And a very cool channel, very cool channel, very cool. Anyway, keep it heavy.